the perfect Nolan game in game number two. And let's look at it once again, taking that first turtle of the fight. And TNT was in a very bad spot here. Actually, when it comes to their turtle dance, it was it really didn't look good. And the fact that Ryzen was taken out early, that really meant so badly for TNT. They, TNT tried to go for the purple buff still afterwards, but then it went into a disastrous situation. Nomad eventually gets a kill, but at what cost? He actually lost so much. And even Hatred picking up the, the Durants now for TNT because they need it. That's how much they really have to fix this composition. That's why we feel that this draft is not looking good for TNT because they really have to solve so much. The triple kill coming out from Outplay, and then eventually the Snowball from Echo. At this point, there's not much that they can do. Look at that well uh, well device play coming out from Echo. With Outplay having the Purify, so there's not much that the, the TNT can do. And in the end, the Heads can only watch as there's nothing that he can do against Echo's composition. This pickup on the glue really is a problem for many, many things. Like, there's no marksman that they can pick up in the lat latter portions of the draft to kind of fix the composition of TNC. And it will be a side of a TNC to lose again, 0-2 against Echo. And now we're looking at the uh, important, uh, important emblems. It's really not much that the, that we that is different. Maybe the fact that glue right now is played not as an actual tank, but still is very tanky with just a common emblem. That, that you saw from Sand 